Well, kia ora koutou and welcome to this week's video newsletter. I'm Gregor, I'm the principal. I've got Rob here who's one of the DPs and Jenny, the head of art. Um, thank you for being here. They're desperate, as you can see, to be on the video <laughs> newsletter. It took no convincing at all. Um, it feels like a really positive and settled start to the year. Mm -hmm. The classes seem to be settled and totally. the year nine seems to have you know, year 19 They're transitioning really well. Yeah, yeah, looking forward to the picnic tonight. Yeah, so hopefully hopefully you get to read this before we have the picnic, We're, but it'll be great to um, meet some more year nine parents and, and hear about their um, son's experience. Now the reason I've got these guys on is they're part of a big team of people that are putting together an, a, a, a really awesome event, which is the Wellington College Art Collection Exhibition. I think I got that right. And that's on the 8th and 9th of March. And this is an opportunity for the community to see some really extraordinary artwork that's got a connection with Wellington College. So Jenny, what are some of the things that are going to be on display? So some of the things that are going to be on display are the um, actual art collection that has been around this college for probably how many years? Many, many uh, over years. Over 100. Yeah, over 100 yeah. years of artwork. So we're going to be displaying that as well as we've got whole range of student artwork. So it starts from year nine with contemporary collage, uh, we've got printmaking, we've got a whole lot of paintings from last year's students, we've got boys that have got scholarship over the last year with their work showing, so I'm really excited about yeah. it. So in that historic collection, there's some Macintyres? Like yes, a, yeah. Uh, well, around the school in the archives and hidden away almost in offices, there's a whole lot of artwork um, that has been here for a long time. And uh, Peter McIntyre features. We've got yeah. three Peter McIntyres. Uh, when he was the official war artist, he um, he painted uh, a couple of paintings of uh, Sir Bernard Freiburg, yeah. who is our eminent old boy, of course. And the college is lucky lucky enough to have uh, a couple of those. Yeah, and he did one of the school too in the nineteen fifties. Yeah, and another really special piece is the Kotawai. Kōrāwai is absolutely yeah. going to be amazing to have that showing as well. We've also got um, the art teachers are putting their work up for sale. They've been busily working hard, even though it's the beginning of term, to produce some beautiful work for sale as well. So, and there'll be prints of that as well. So, one thing I love yeah. about the Wellington College Art Department, Jenny, is that we've got practicing artists, absolutely. and one of our school values is learning together. That idea of aku, and this is going to be a feature of this ex exhibition that we're going to have student work and. We're going to have student work and, and teachers' work displayed alongside each other. That's really special. And yeah. of course, we're lucky enough now that we've got a fantastic uh, centre that we can yeah. show this art. So yeah, we're also an opportunity for people to see the um, Alan Gibbs Centre, our new Performing Arts and Memorial Hall Centre, so awesome. Yeah. Um, now, we really want people to focus on that Friday night, Friday the 8th of March from 6 o'clock. That's our gala opening. Yeah, from 6 to 8. Yes. Yeah. And that is, there's going to be an opportunity to have um, some nibbles, um, some drink, and to view the artwork. Mm -hmm. And you can buy tickets for that through our website. Yeah. Um, and uh, the money, Rob, we've got two things. We've got, first of all, yeah. you talk about the plaques. Well, what we have, um, we've had ever since the, the first hall was built, the Memorial Hall, were brass plaques memorialising the soldiers who were killed in World War One, and then the soldiers who were killed in World War Two. Uh, and also a, a young guy who was killed in Afghanistan and we've had their plaques up on the wall. Yeah. Uh, what we are doing is getting all those plaques, in fact they go back to the board or even, uh, to be, they're being refurbished yeah. and cleaned and they will be uh, put up again yeah. in, the, in the new hall. So we hope to make a feature of that at our Anzac Assembly yep. at the end of the term. And Jenny, there's also a key piece of equipment for the art Absolutely, we're yeah. hoping that there is a little bit of um, left over for the etching press that's desperately needed in um, one of our art rooms, so yeah. Awesome. Can we thank all the people um, that are involved with this, um, uh, putting together this exhibition, so big shout out to Ali and her team. Amazing. Um, uh, and, job. Yeah. and also the sponsors who have got on board, yeah. we'll certainly be promoting you on the night. Okay, that's all we've got time for, we've well and truly gone over our three minutes. So, uh, Kakiti, have a great weekend, and um, thanks, Jenny and Rob, Thank and you. we'll see you guys Thank next you. week. Bye bye. Thank you.